Mayor Aaron Stewart, the exciting, bubbly young mayor of New Britain, has brought back Main Street USA. However, this year it will not be on Main Street. It will be at Walnut Hill Park tomorrow. Congratulations on bringing this event back. Did you attend this as a as a youngster when Dad was mayor? <laughs> Good morning, Bob. No, when my father was mayor, we didn't have Main Street USA. Okay. So- this is the return. The last time it was held was in 1999 for a New Britain sesquicentennial celebration, and it kind of fell off after that. But since I've been mayor, it's one thing that everybody has constantly asked, when are you bringing back Main Street USA? This is a festival that used to bring 60,000 people to downtown New Britain every, every first Saturday in June. Uh, and we wanted to make sure that we could continue that tradition, so we figured, hey, you know what? We tried it with Oktoberfest. I don't know if you remember that. Last year, two years in a row, Mm -hmm. we had the Oktoberfest celebration. But we wanted to do something a little bit more uniquely New Britain. And everybody is excited about this. We're going from 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. There's going to be tons of vendors and food and things for the kids to do. We're doing hot air balloon rides, helicopter rides. There's going to be lots of music and fun. And, of course, a beer garden, too. Wait a minute. (laughs) Helicopter rides, too? Helicopter ride too. Oh man, I might have. Well, no, I have to work tomorrow. I got football tomorrow. Sorry. <laughs> uh, so, and you mentioned ten to ten, and there's also some uh, music going on. What kind of acts are we talking about here? We've got tons of music. We've got two different stages. So we have a community stage that's running from noon until eight p.m., and that has all local entertainment. A lot of our local, our YWCA dance groups, our student groups, our bands from the high school and the middle school will be performing. But then on the main stage at the Shell. We're starting off with Kimmy Maya at noon, and every two hours we're changing uh, different acts. So we're ending at 8 o'clock with Dr. K's Motown Funk Review. Very nice. Now, for those who have never been to Walnut Hill Park, what's, what, size, what size park are we talking about here? Oh, Walnut Hill Park is huge. It's one of our, our gems of the city. Uh, but this is over on the west end of town, almost kind of like by the Berlin town line. But... Um, it's uh, one of the highlights of the city of New Britain. It sits uh, right adjacent to the New Britain Museum of American Art. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to have anyone park actually in the park. So we've opened up all three of our city parking garages, and DATCO is so graciously providing us with transportation. So every 10 minutes, there's going to be another shuttle bus to shuttle you from any one of the city's parking garages up to the park, which is not far by any means. Oh, Roger hooked you up. Very, very nice. That's good to hear. Now, <laughs> yeah. now for those who, who, who used to attend this now, it's called Main Street USA. Now, it's not on Main Street this year because there's a lot of work being done on Main Street, correct? Yeah, it's not on Main Street this year because our Main Street is uh, under construction at the moment. We're doing a massive streetscape renovation project. So our, our central park is completely dug up at the moment. So it wouldn't really be conducive to having a street festival. Um, but hopefully that project's going to be going on for the next few years. So we're going to see how it works in the park. And then hopefully in a couple of years, bring it right back down to Main Street. Mary Aaron, so, oh, sorry, go ahead. No, in the meantime, we have we have Main Street signs. So Walnut Hill Park will be Main Street for the day. <laughs> so, yeah, right. Aaron Stewart, the mayor of New Britain, yeah. is with us here for a few minutes. The event is tomorrow, 10 to 10 at Walnut Hill Park in New Britain. When did the wheels in motion, when did this really get going for you to bring this back? I know you mentioned a lot of people always asked about it, but when did it really sure. get serious to get this thing back going? I started talking about this probably a little over a year ago. So that's how long the planning has taken and how long the process has started. So about a year ago, we got together and uh, I said, here's what I want to the Parks and Recreation Department. And they said, all right, we're going to make it happen. (laughs) Right. And I imagine you have sponsors, too. There's a lot of uh, corporate help to, to help get this going. We do. We do have a lot of corporate help. Our new corporate uh, partner in Costco, which will be opening up a new store in New Britain in just uh, a little under a month now, is one of our our biggest sponsors. (laughs) Yeah. Now, is that the one, Costco, is that the one who uh, built the place uh, by the golf course? Yes. Okay. got it. Yeah, I remember that. uh, There had to be a little bit of selling of land, right, to get that done? Yeah, it took... uh, it took about four years for it to happen on the government side of things, mm. and once we got it through, it's, they're building it in about 110 days. So yeah. October 15th, they'll be opening. <laughs> All right. In the minute or so we have left, what else is going on new in New Britain? Oh, we are so busy in New Britain, and I am so grateful to be the mayor of a town that's on uh, making a true comeback. Like I said, we've got tons of construction projects going on downtown. We're going to make downtown the place to be again. We're digging up all of our Central Park, expanding our sidewalks, making it easier for people to walk to and from where they they need to be. 
because of the busway, we're seeing so much opportunity. Broad Street, a little Poland is thriving. We've got over 100 small businesses now on Broad Street. But in addition to that, we're also bringing jobs to our community. We've got Polymer Precision, uh, which just opened a multi-million dollar facility, bringing over 200 well-paying jobs to New Britain residents. we got things all over the place, Bob, and <laughs> we're not stopping, that's for sure. Yeah, she's rocking. And also, I will tell you this, in the last year, uh, they put turf down at Veterans Memorial Stadium, where the, goal, where the Hurricanes play, and it's become a, a good site now again for the CIAC football and soccer finals. That might be one of the smartest moves you folks ever made, was converting that to turf. Absolutely. You know, we're putting in a second field right now, too, at Chesley Park. So there's a second field of that caliber going in over on the by the Newington side of town. That's good stuff. Mayor, hopefully it works out tomorrow. You have a great day for it, and certainly the weathermen came through for you. Thank you. Hopefully we see everybody come out to Walnut Hill Park tomorrow, 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. for Main Street USA. All right, Aaron. Thanks. Have a great weekend. You too. Bye-bye. All right, thanks. It's Aaron Stewart, the mayor. Boy, I wasn't kidding when I said when I said she's bubbly. Oh. She 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 just provides that energy. She she does has done a very good job there in New Britain and she should be commended. I remember they gave her so much gripe for being young. So what? She's long she's good energy. She has a, you know, good dad who, you know, she probably uh, has a uh, Asked about you know talked uh, about things uh, in, during her, her tenure as mayor, and it seemed to be worked. It seemed to have worked out well, huh? All right, seven fifty seven. 